Hey YouTubers, is uh, this a familiar sound? I'm going to show you how to fix it. Alright, the first thing you want to do is diagnose what the problem is. It's either an alignment problem with the pulley or a tensioner problem uh, where the, there's not enough tension put on the belt. What you do, you get a little water bottle and you put it on the rib side of the serpentine belt and if it gets quiet, then it's a problem with one of the pulleys and if it gets louder, then it's a problem with the actual tension on the belt. So I spray a little water in there and you can see it got quiet for a few seconds. So that just means there's a problem with one of the pulleys, the alignment's off, something like that. So let's, uh, now that we've diagnosed it, let's figure out what the problem is. Okay, so here's how you take off the serpentine belt. First, you gotta rig up something with a wrench and a pipe uh, because this portion doesn't allow you enough room to get this breaker bar in there. So you gotta rig this up and you hook it on that tensioner pulley and you just pull, pull it back like that and that'll give you enough room to reach in there and, and pull that belt off. So we went and looked at the pulleys and we determined that this tensioner pulley is it's got more play in it than than desired so we can kind of wiggle that a little bit so we're going to undo this this 15 millimeter bolt here and then we'll pull it out all right so we got the bolt out here i'm just gonna finish hand loosening this pull that out and take that pulley off and drop it down <laughs> to the bottom Alright, so we've got the old tensioner pulley off, and we got this uh, Duralast here that we're about to slap on. Okay, so we've got the new one on, and we just need to tighten up that, that bolt, and then we're going to put our serpentine belt back on. Okay, here's how you know that you've got the bolt tightened in. You can, uh, the tensioner will start to flex instead of actually tightening down. So once you've got that in, Time to put the serpentine belt back on. Another key is, as you tighten, when you tighten this, you're, you're tightening it in the direction that the pulley rotates. So if you don't get it tight enough, it'll self-tighten because of the rotation is in the tightening direction. All right, we've got the serpentine belt back on. Just remember, you want to pull that bolt down, and that's uh, that's how you get the serpentine belt back on. And you find your little diagram like this, and you just weave it, weave it through just like that. And there you go, no more squeaking. If you got any questions, comment below. Subscribe to my channel, Robin Two Scraps, out.